evaluate new available roots of for peaches. We planted uh, trials, free trials, in two locations. Of course, we want to evaluate more rootstocks for sandy soils. The one site was selected at Slanghoek, Gaudini, where we have 82% uh, sand and uh, also the presence of ring nematodes as well as fluctuating water tables. We planted the trees at 4 by 2, two liter system. Early blush was the cyan and it was planted on 11 rootstocks. The other side, uh, also a sandy uh, soil, was at Buchenhout Fallwater, 79% uh, sand, also ring nematodes present and we planted a 4 by 1.5 meter central leader system. Snow Angel was the cyan and we've used five rootstocks. The other uh, site was also at fall water, but it was a heavier soil, 45% sand only. Also ring nematodes uh, present. We planted at a 4 by 2 two liter system and it was planted on nine rootstocks. The rootstocks uh, evaluated was OSM 99.3, it's a Florida Guard times Armand crossing, also OSM 99.2, Pete's times Armand crossing. These two uh, rootstocks was bred by the ARC at Stellenbosch. Uh, we also use Guardian peach uh, rootstock, Coast Guard peach rootstock, Barrier peach uh, times uh, Prunus de Vidiana, a wild uh, peach. Uh, we also use Rootback 70 a peach times almond and Garnem also a peach times almond rootstock. At the Slanghoek, there was no significant yield differences during the second harvest. But over two seasons, the yield of the trees on Kalkama seedling uh, were significantly poorer compared to the trees on Barrier and Guardian. At Buchenhout, uh, the third year yield was significantly lower due to climatic conditions. But over a three year period, trees on Okinawa, OSM 99 and Florida Gas did not uh, differ significantly from each other and also had the highest yield and fruit weight. At uh, Buchenhout, trees on Kalkama seedling had the lowest yield and uh, fruit weight and were also the weakest growers. At Waterfall, over the three year period, trees on Okinawa, Florida Guard, and OSM 99.3, as well as Kalkama seating, did not differ significantly and had the highest yield. The first three also had the best fruit weight. At Slanghoek, the two Harvest seasons were not really enough to make any conclusive uh, conclusions. Uh, and at fall water uh, in the northern parts, the 2019 uh, season, we had cold temperatures during bloom and low cold units during winter. Uh, this also made 2019 results inconclusive for foul water. We want to acknowledge all our funders and everybody involved.